What is going on guys? Kevin up at Like Bros coming back to another video today. This one is a set I paid $160 for, and this one is a lot I paid $160 for. <laughs> uh, so we're gonna see the difference between the two, I guess. Uh, this one will just be really quick. Uh, I believe I'm going to end up, well, I'm gonna hang on to this one for a while anyway, so I'm not sure exactly what I'm gonna do with it. But uh, if you guys do have any interest in any of the stuff that you see today, stores.ebay.com slash legbros, where you can find this stuff. Always join us on Whatnot as well. You can get your, uh, credit up to $200 if you're super lucky. Most people get 10, uh, but, uh, all you do is sign up in the link below, make an account, make a purchase, and then boom, free credit. You can use that towards one of my figs or somebody else's. There's a lot of great sellers over on whatnot. Uh, I'm not on there as much. I do plan on making a return at some point soon. Uh, so this one is a real quick one. This is just a real nice good old <laughs> UCS ATST chicken walker to some. Uh, has the book and everything like that. It is actually mostly built it looks like. Um, I'm gonna unbuild it and then build it again just for the fun of it. Uh, this is one of the ones that I always regretted kind of getting rid of. So I have one now. I don't know if I'm gonna get rid of it. Obviously, uh, if I needed to, I will. But I wanted to build one up again and uh, take a look at it for a little while. <laughs> I, I do like Lego. You know, it's it's not just. I mean, it is it is a business for me, but I do I do dabble and I do enjoy it. I don't have a giant collection, but uh, you know. I do some stuff. <laughs> this one was $160. A whole bunch of random figs in here. I saw one in particular that was quite interesting to me, and I'm not sure if anybody else did. There was a lot of kind of junk figs in here, uh, or just reg regular figs. I think there was a lot of city and stuff like that as well. But I think uh, that there was a little bitty in here that uh, I, don't know if, I don't know if a whole bunch of people saw. Let's hope that it's not correct. Let's hope that it's awesome. Let's hope that uh, we did well. And then we'll go forward from there. Comment below if you already saw him. Oh, it's a him. There we go. Give away. Spoilers. <laughs> it is this. No, that's a girl. Sorry, it's not that one. That's not that one. Uh, Han Solo. You know, that's a girl too, it looks like. That's a girl in Solo cosplay. It's got to be Obi-Wan Kenobi, right? Oh, Obi-Wan Kenobi with a mustache. That's not a good sign. That's not a good sign. Look at that mustache, though. Cool um, uh, hobgoblin hood, though. Uh, we'll keep that. It's this guy. Hello there. His hand was up and everything. He said, hello, my name is Jedi Bob. I am hopefully not cracked. That is not a crack. That's that mold mark, the old school mold mark. Oh, boys. Oh, he is beautiful. Holy cow, look at that cape even. Little dust, but no fraying. Yep, yep, well, that guy paid for the lot, so <laughs> hopefully we can find something else in here, because uh, that'd be pretty cool. I like finding other things as well, uh, but that's a good start. That is a good start. Let's see what else we can find here, though. That could be kind of cool. I've never seen this guy with actual wings on. That's kind of neat. This is one of those mechs from, uh, what is it, Galaxy Squad or something to that effect. Um, yeah, never seen the wings before. That's kind of neat. I'll put that guy right there because I don't know what he's worth. There is a uh, ARF troop, just a standard ARF troop. That's actually pretty decent as well. Uh, here we have a mix-up of Riddler and Hydra henchmen. There is hiding behind the coffee, just a, I've actually never seen that dark green torso before, but just a city fig, nothing much there. Uh, there's a rebel friend with a great mustache as well. Look at these knights. About 10 bucks a piece you can expect from most knights. This one is Luke Skywalker in his old version, which actually has become a ting, surprisingly. Uh, we also have Cassian Andor, which is also a free ting, as we could say from here on out. Uh, we also have a little snake right there, printed hair figs. Look at the old castle breastplate right there. We have, that's a good head, but not a good body. That's the UPS driver is what I call those guys. <laughs> uh, here's a rebel commando, which are always fun to get. Not worth a whole lot, but they are fun. Uh, that is a serious fig on some fake legs. We'll get rid of those fake legs right here, doing the community a service. Oh, hello there. Don't mind if I do, absolutely beautiful. Uh, there's a little bit, I think that might come off though. Uh, beautiful, no crack, Endor, no, Endor. Dagobah, yep, I, I, know, I know Star Wars. <laughs> uh, Dagobah Luke right there, that is beautiful. 
he has come up in value as well. We have old school, old Leia, Rebel, what is that? The Rebel Transport Ship Leia? Don't remember what her value is. I don't think it's very high, to be honest, but uh, I don't remember. I just I just don't remember. What is this guy from? He looks like some kind of some kind of resistance guy, rebel guy. I don't know. Uh, this one is a good one. This is Bosk from the Bounty Hunter Battle Pack, I believe is what that one came from. Bosk is a great one. We have Groot. Here we have our supposed to have coattails Alfred. He feels he's kind of shiny, but I think he's I think he's real. Yeah. Shiny, but no coattails. I'll have to see if we have some coattails for him. I think he sits a little bit further down. Uh, but that's actually a great fig, too. Just sold him today, actually, this morning. <laughs> sold the only one that I had this morning. So hopefully I can find some coattails, get that guy back up there. There's an Exo Force Butler from the alley. <laughs> He's got a mix of stories going on there. Oh, don't mind if I do, free Cologne Lieutenant. Uh, well, it wasn't Jedi Bob, so, you know. Wasn't Dagobah Luke, so we're happy with that. We're happy with that. I probably have a torso I can use for that guy anyway. Uh, there is Hulk going to space. This is Endgame Hulk. Endgame Bruce Banner. You didn't know that, did you? We have a Tusken Raider, of course. Here is our Dodge Challenger racer. Yep, that's what I'm going to go with. <laughs> Here's just a good old ZX Cole. Uh, City Fig, not much there. This guy's got the, uh, that's actually one of the better Rebel Resistance helmets. Uh, goes to, what's that guy's name? Yeah, I don't remember what that guy's name is. Uh, also a cool little uh, Nexo Knight robot guy. Here is the Celt, Celtic Warrior, whatever his name is, some, some, some kind of warrior. We got a pilot. There is a good piece of a elf and a pilot. I don't remember which pilot that goes to. That's going to be research as well. And we'll do a Hoth Rebel. Might as well just throw a bark helmet in there, shall we? You shall. And some other useful pieces. We have, I believe that is Energy Kai, uh, along with, it could be Air Jitsu too, along with Chen and Spin Jitsu Cole, maybe? There's a Rebel Friend's head. Uh, nothing there. Woo! It's Angry Woo. Angry Business Woo. You don't want to see him put his business face on. Uh, more printed hair figs right there. Why is the camera so blurry? What the heck's going on here? Uh, nothing there, nothing there. There is a tribal warrior from series. Uh, let's see, is that the same helmet? Nope, that's a different helmet. That one, I believe, is a U-wing pilot helmet, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, there's another rebel, Hoth rebel. We got Anna with her little cape. We have... That looks like a friend's fig, I'm gonna say. Don't remember which one. Rachel, maybe. Uh, nothing there, nothing there. This could be one of those helmet guys. The gray pilot? I always have to look all the pilots up. I just, I don't remember the pilot. Pilots is too much to ask for me. <laughs> Here's one of the original, um, great print on this guy. One of the original tech, is it technicians or what is he? He's like, he's the one that wears the helmet, right? He's supposed to just have that regular, um, I think it's like a plain smiley face, but beige. Uh, and then there's an Anakin face on there as well, which we will use. Here is a Spider-Man that is fakety fakety. Uh, let's put him in the fakety drawer right there. We do have a rebooted Cole, another type of pilot. We've gotten all sorts of types of pilots here. This is a series fig as well. Actually not bad in terms of the value. It looks like series figs have come up a little bit uh, in terms of value, kind of uh, hopeful <laughs> they continue that rise. We have a bomb squad trooper and I don't know what that torso is. That's because it is fake. Uh-huh, 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 yep. Fakety, fake, fake. All right, let's throw him where that other guy came from. Uh, nothing there, nothing there. There we go, there is the awesome gigantic helmet they quickly realized the backlash on those those size of helmets uh i mean it actually is pretty accurate because those helmets were gigantic they just look really funny on many figures uh but that is a fantastic figure about 30 bucks for that luke currently 25 to 30 bucks i would say uh which is great i'll take that uh there's a catwoman helmet on just a bunch of nothing we got elsa's hair piece that would make sense since we got anna there's a zane headpiece there's another just regular pilot uh, and a Luke helmet. We have Lloyd from the movie. Here is an old school Lion Knight. We got the fake Captain America on a Lobot torso, which is interesting. Here's another of our friend Bomb Squad. 
This goes to that other pilot that we saw, this guy. Poe? Is this actually just Poe? Does he have a regular suit? That might just be Poe. Uh, which, in which case, that actually could be slightly decent. I don't know. Uh, I don't remember what that guy is. There's Kai. We have... What the heck is that? I don't know what that one is either. That one goes along with that other rebel that I had now. These two. They look like they maybe go to the same set. Research. We have Jay in his... Uh, Street clothes. Let's see. Printed hair figs. Nothing there. There's a pilot. Ooh. General Radis. Don't mind if I do. Not cracked. Thank you very much. Great fig right there. And also the other version of Luke Skywalker. We put his other old form here. This one is not quite as valuable as the white form. Oh, but it is a good one. I'll take that. I, I just sold one of those recently as well. So we'll put that one back in stock. Look at that hair piece. Hello. Uh, nothing there. Nothing. Whose head is that? Somebody's head. Duke Kaboom, maybe? Something like that? This is shot in the dark. Somebody look it up and tell me if I'm right in the comments. Uh, <laughs> there's a parademon. We got another J. Ooh, Starfire. This is the, uh, what is it called? It's not the regular Starfire. This is the uh, Teen Titans version. Or, no, I, I don't know. It, Dimensions version? No, yeah, yes, Dimensions version. That's the Dimensions version of it. Uh-huh, I got it. <laughs> There's a Minecraft guy. Uh, this one actually is the Bespin Guard, which is kind of neat. Uh, it's kind of mid-value right there. Uh, this one is yellowed beyond belief, unfortunately, because that is a Horn Company, one of my favorite types of clones right there. And we have the babysitter, apparently, or the dad. I mean, he could be a dad. Let's be honest, he could be a dad. He's wearing the, he's wearing the baby proudly, though. There's another Lion Knight. We have another, there's old school Luke with the old gray legs and that head. Uh, we could use this head if you guys want to make it real interesting and put it right on here, because that's where that head belongs. Uh, we also have Spider-Man. We never get this guy. He is in mint condition. No kid play. Love to see that. Love to see that on the Spider-Man and not anything else. <laughs> I think those are Mr. E-Legs. That is a um, Knight's Kingdom or something like that torso, along with a Jellyfish Man and a Sons of Garmadon face. Nice little mix. Nice little mix to go right there. This guy is up to no good. Yep, you could tell by the look of him. I've never seen that torso before. I'm going to look that up too. Another Spider-Man. That one's quite a bit more valuable than the other one. We have Kid Garmadon with the wrong face. I wish it was the right face because I do need a ton of those. And it has the wrong cape as well. Uh, is this real? the heck they made like a i didn't know they made a short black spongy cape unless they cut it Did they make a short black spongy cape i don't know now i'm gonna have to look <laughs> there's some kind of doctor probably series we got lord business in the house there is a uh another bomb squad whose face is that can't think of it right off the top of my head and we have our little street clothes zane as well to round that out 160 bucks well spent this time the set's cool as well uh not it's not gonna be like what, what happened to the camera here it's showing showing some cracks in the desk there <laughs> anyways comment below what your favorite one of the day was i actually happen to have two of these guys sitting right here waiting for their backpacks what i'm looking for is the neck brace uh, this is what he's supposed to have right there. So I haven't posted these guys because I was looking, this is a uh, bluish gray, dark bluish gray neck piece, but he's supposed to have the uh, dark gray neck piece, which then I looked on BrickLink and it's like $10. So uh, I might just, um, I don't know what I'm going to do there. Maybe just, <laughs> maybe just put a regular neck piece on him. I don't really feel like spending $20 on neck, well, now $30 on neck pieces. Uh, I think I might only have two backpacks though. So anyways, comment below. Love you guys. Thank you very much for spending 14 minutes of your life with me. Hit that button. I'll catch you in the next one.